So I'm Jessica. We are here to play pickleball. It's my first tournament and we're just here to have fun and do something as a couple and get away from our three children. <laughs> <laughs> my name's Mark. Yeah, first tournament together. Um, I've played a couple of tournaments, but it's uh, all about the cardio, the exercise, <laughs> and just the community social networking. It's really cool to talk with people. Yeah, I guess I got into it. My parents play, he plays, so I'm like, the whole family's playing. I think I like my grandma plays. Not age discriminant, anybody can pick it up, so it's just fun to get out there and run around. It's really just being able to work together, right? We like winning together, we like losing together, because then we can work on what we should improve. But overall, it's just really fun to get out here and do bonding together on an activity that's not cleaning the dishes or vacuuming the living room or something like that. <laughs> this is my first tournament, so I didn't know what to expect, but everybody's just friendly and friendly play, so getting to meet a lot of people. Um, I feel like, I mean, it's been pool play, so we haven't seen too much competitiveness come out yet, but it's fun to just warm up and play with people of all skill levels that we wouldn't play with normally at home. What was the city they lived in? The pa no, no, they said it's past. Oh. Uh, Palmyra. Palmyra? Yeah. yeah, I didn't know Palmyra, Utah was a city, but now I want to go move there. It sounds heavenly and they were really fun to play with. <laughs> I like how these tournaments, nobody feels like they have to be a professional. It's not like we're, you know, professional pickleball players. So win or lose, we got to get out, have fun. And even with the slams, you just congratulate the other person. <laughs> you, I'm Kim and I I'm addicted. <laughs> and I'm Brandy, and I'm addicted. We play five days, sometimes six days a week. We're here to support Spanish Fork City. We've met so many nice pickleball friends. We're pickleball yeah, BFFs. We are. We went on a cruise, not for pickleball. But because but a pickleball. pickleball, it's just a great place to meet people. Meet people and have friends we of have all new, ages. We have new friends. Hey, Reese, 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 say hi okay. to Spanish Fork City. They're from Provo. They're our BFFs too. Sorry, like, yeah, we're just really happy that Spanish Fork came up with these awesome courts. They're awesome. And the Fiesta Days puts us in with the, the tournament and have some fun. It's a great way to start Fiesta Days. We love it. It's family oriented. Yeah, it is. It's, I love it that it's multi generational. It's multi athleticism ish. The young, the right. old, anybody can play. And right. Spanish Fork City has the best courts ever. We had moved down to this area just a few months before they started building these courts and you know we'd heard of pickleball and we're like what in the world are they building 16 pickleball courts for <laughs> and so we just kind of started playing and just experiment with a little bit you know how you experiment with something just a little bit and then <laughs> it's it's a great and then now we say that's the reason we moved down here is because we're just a hop skip and a jump from the pickleball courts <laughs> and this park in general just a beautiful park. The trails, the whole, you can walk around this park and see every sport being played and every kind of family, every kind of, it's just a great place to be. It gives our children something to do. Yeah. Our kids have somewhere to go at night. Our right. teenage kids, our younger kids, well, families us, can go. Older people too. Older people. Old and this is for, it's for everybody. It is. This Old, is young. There's eight-year-olds playing down here at night that are awesome. Fifteen-year-olds. Eighty-four-year-olds. Eighty-four-year-olds. <laughs> Maybe more than that. Yeah. So. And also, people stop here from out of state. Um, you have pickleball apps, yeah. and it tells you where pickleball. So we've played with people from California, Florida, all over. Yeah. But definitely, the Parks and Rec, it's a great place to put some money. <laughs> yes, it's an awesome, awesome for our community. We're to the point now, both of us, when you move up a level, it's about strategy. It's not speed. It's so we end up playing in these tournaments a little bit with a lot of people that like to do the hard you know, maybe more of a tennis type game. But you get to strat. Right. We're at the strategy. When you get it's strategy, patience. Is, use the short game and the soft game. And that's where it's really fun to us. <laughs> so yeah, thank you, Spanish Fork. Yep. And Tracy, she's amazing. Oh, Tracy is. Tracy. She is amazing. Yep. Can't Go say Tracy. Good about Tracy. And her programs that she runs, she's awesome. Yeah, well, I'm Andrew Lovell. I'm Allie Peary. And uh, we're out here playing pickleball because uh, personally I love to be competitive, love to stay in shape, but it's good all around for, for me. Yeah, I love that it's competitive, gets me outside, and um, just meeting lots of different people. 
Yeah, well, we're playing uh, in the higher level. I think uh, it's it's the 4-0 plus group, and you still get a few people that are still trying to learn. So it's you, you get a little mix of everything. So if you're ever scared, I mean, just come out. Everyone's super nice. Pickleball is one of the most inviting, friendly sports I think I've ever been involved in. So. Yeah, I think that's one of the fun dynamics about pickleball is there's two people and sometimes, you know, people are different levels or sometimes they're the same and you have to just communicate and play together, so. Uh, sometimes I'm a little more aggressive, so on my third, they, they call it third shot drop and instead of doing a third shot uh, drop into the kitchen, I'll, I'll uh, be very aggressive and kind of drive it and that usually makes them pop it up and that sets it up for a perfect slam, so that's kind of one of the shots that I, that I take out sometimes. Uh, I think lobs are fun and kind of throw people off sometimes or, you know, switching up your serve, serving really short, um, sometimes just, yeah, confuses people. We're just friends and uh, we met through mutual uh, friends who play pickleball and so even Ali and myself, I think, just playing, getting to play each other uh, and with each other, I, you know, it's like, cool, we can play doubles again soon and there's, other, there's a lot of really cool people out here uh, who we've met and who would we consider playing again with. Yeah, I think, like you said, it's the nature of pickleball. It's so inviting. Everyone loves to play together, and um, usually you come out of a tournament like making new friends and having new people to play against.